It's a new bill in Washington state that supporters say will improve the safety of tow truck drivers on the job. Senate Bill 5023 was unanimously passed in both chambers of the legislature and is now on its way to Governor Jay Inslee's desk for a signature. Fox 12's Connor McCarthy spoke to the daughter of a tow truck driver who was killed while helping a driver in 2001 about what this bill means for her family. Arthur Anderson was killed in 2021 while helping out a spun out car along I-5 near Kelso. But now a new law will bear his name alongside Raymond Mitchell. He's another Longview tow truck driver that was killed helping out another car in September of 2021. But Arthur's daughter says when this new law is enacted, it will help save lives and prevent more tragic deaths of tow truck drivers here in Washington state. Nearly two years after Arthur Anderson was hit and killed while on the job, his family is still grieving. Sparkles Chisholm still wears the t-shirt for her father's tow truck company. You know, when a car breaks down or when you see somebody on the freeway and, you know, it's very, still very hard, very emotional. Sparkles and her family have a new way to remember Arthur. Senate Bill 5023. It was unanimously passed by both chambers of the Washington State Legislature and will head to the governor's desk. Once it's signed, it will be called the Arthur Anderson and Raymond Mitchell Tow Operator Safety Act. Raymond Mitchell was also killed when a car struck him while he was trying to tow a disabled vehicle on I-5. You know, the Mitchell family feels the same as I do, you know, having the name on the bill because, you know, of the accident. It makes a difference, you know, for our family, for the community, for us. Like, you know what, our, our traumatic injuries or traumatic accidents that happened to us is being heard finally. This new law will require drivers to slow down to a maximum of 50 miles per hour when they're passing an accident on the freeway. It will also allow tow trucks to use rear facing flashing red and blue lights, similar to what police cars and ambulances use when they're at emergency scenes. Sparkle says this will help communicate to drivers that there is a serious situation ahead. It gives alertness from a mile of, you know, distance of miles, you know, that you could see ahead of time, like, hey, there's something going on up here. So it gives you time to slow down and move over. According to AAA, on average, 60 tow truck drivers across the country die each year while on the job. Sparkle says this soon to be new law will help reduce that number. Everybody deserves to go home. Washington Governor Jay Inslee is expected to sign Senate Bill 5023 into law up in Olympia, but here in Longview, the driver who allegedly hit and killed Arthur back in 2021, well, her trial is continuing right here behind me at the Cowlitz County Courthouse. In Longview, Connor McCarthy, Fox 12 Oregon.